Hello there. It may feel at the moment like low pressure is almost like a clingy ex-partner. It doesn't quite know when to quit. And indeed, while Saturday's low pressure is slowly clearing off, we've got another one waiting in the wings for Sunday. It's been powered in by the jet stream, which is still stuck to the south of the UK. And it's going to be bringing in these weather fronts as we head towards the start of the new working week as well, with showers and longer spells of rain pushing their way through. If we rewind to Saturday evening though, for the time being at least, it's this low pressure centre that's still with us and that will be providing further heavy showers across parts of Northern Ireland, Western Scotland, merging into longer spells of rain at times, particularly across parts of Argyle and Butte, maybe the odd rumble of thunder in there as well. A few showers pushing into Western England, parts of Wales as well, but generally further east you are, you'll stay dry throughout much of the night with some clear skies. The breeze, though, is still in place from where we have seen today, and that will be mixing up the air, preventing temperatures dropping too far. Most places holding up around 12, 14 degrees Celsius or so, but we might drop into single figures across the far northeast of Scotland where those winds are just a touch lighter. Showers in place from the word go across parts of central southern Scotland and then they'll transfer their way into northern England as well. Still the potential that some of those are heavy. Southeastern areas of England actually faring relatively well first thing in the morning. Some sunny spells but we'll be watching as this rain and cloud starts to push its way in from the west. Steadily progressing into Wales, southwest England and then into northern Ireland later on as well. Skies turning largely grey and a lot damper theme as we head into the afternoon as well blustery once again. Temperatures will be held back underneath this cloud, so not much higher than 19, 20 degrees Celsius. But where you do hold on to the sunshine further towards the east into parts of Scotland as well, 20, 21, up to 23 degrees Celsius is possible, and it will relatively be pleasant in those sunnier spells. As we head into the evening then, we'll be watching this rain push its way eastwards, could turn persistent across parts of the Northern Ireland into Northern England. Certainly some spray on roads is possible if you are travelling later on Sunday here. Outbreaks of rain continuing across much of England and Wales throughout the night. The winds also strengthening further. Potential for some coastal gales, perhaps 40 mile an hour gusts of wind across Wales, southwest England to begin with, and then that will then transfer its way across the English Channel as we do head into the early hours of Monday morning. Much lighter winds across Scotland though, and it will be staying largely dry for much of the northern areas of the mainland, and actually might turn locally chilly under those clear skies as well, down into mid-single figures for some sheltered glens. In the south though, where we hold on to all that rain and cloud, the humidity is also going to be building, could be turned into quite a muggy night in places, temperatures not much lower than 16 or 17 degrees Celsius. This rain will continue on and off as we head into Monday as well, but lingering first thing across parts of southern England as the winds eventually ease their way off. But also this band across parts of northern England into northern Ireland and southern Scotland. The exact location of that, there is still some model variability in where it wants to be placed. So it is worth keeping up to date with the forecast in terms of how far north that rain may track, or if it just sticks slightly further to the south throughout much of the day. But where it is in place, it's not going to be particularly pleasant start to the week at all. It is going to be northern Scotland where we see the best of the sunshine throughout Monday. Relatively light winds once again and in that sunshine it should feel too pleasant at all. Temperatures climbing to highs of 18 degrees Celsius. A few brighter spells are possible across parts of central southern England later on into the afternoon but here we are still holding on to that humidity and where the brightness begins to poke through it will just make things that bit stickier as well into the rest of Monday and that rain will continue to clear its way through and there is the potential for further rain and showers as we head into Tuesday and Wednesday as well. So keep up to date with the latest as we head forward across all of our social media channels and we'll be back with you very soon. Bye bye.